I want to share something with you guys. Have you ever had a situation at a bank, a banking institution where you deposited your money and then all of a sudden you go to check your account later and you don't find the money that you deposited? Well, I saw this story on my way out. I'm going to share it with you. Um, two people on that particular story shared that they deposited their money into their accounts, big money. And when they went to check on it later on that day, there was no indication that the deposits took place. Fortunately for them, they kept receipts. But I'm telling you what, there are people out here that do not keep their receipts. And a hard copy is your best chance of recovering your finances from wherever it mysteriously disappeared to. Now, I had this situation happen to me recently, so I can relate to this. I had two accounts set up for my grandchildren, and automatic deposits should have gone into those. And it did, initially. Those accounts were perfect. It was all set up. They got their funds every single month, just like I asked them to divvy it up into each one of those accounts. All of a sudden, there was no deposit. There were no deposits into their account. And I looked at that account on a Friday evening, y'all. So you know, my nerves were shattered because I could not reach the bank, not by phone. All you got was a prompt from one prompt to another prompt to another prompt until you got back to the original one. You couldn't speak to any real person until Monday. So you can imagine by Monday, I was livid. So by the time I got to the bank and explained my situation calmly, believe it or not, I kept my calm. You cannot handle a situation if both parties are not calm. I'm telling you the truth. Excuse me. <clears throat> but anyway, bottom line was they found out where the money was. My money happened to be in the account, the primary account, and it was not distributed properly. So that was my problem. And I was so thankful that all they had to do is find out where the money was and then put it where it should have gone. And so at the end of it, I asked what was really the problem so that we don't have to experience this again. Because like I said, my nerves were shattered. Where is my money? All they could say is there was a glitch in the system. That's the term used lately for everything and anything that has to do with technology. That glitch in the system rocked my world. And I know for a fact, if I didn't have hard copy of everything I had done, I would have really, really been in a bind. So I'm telling you, I'm recommending and suggesting you could do whatever you want because I see people coming out of supermarkets. I see people coming out of all kinds of different institutions where they have purchased items or deposited item monies and, and their receipts are on the ground. That's not going to help me at all if I need to run back and see where my money's went or what I spent it for or even if I have to exchange something. If I don't have a receipt, in most cases, you can't even exchange items. So I'm just saying, check out this particular article that I'm talking about. I'm going to leave it in the comments below. I'm going to leave it uh, below, and you can check it out when you want to. But I'm telling you, it's a good idea to pay attention to all of your finances. I have another story about banking, uh, my mortgage. But I'm going to share that later because I got to run right now.